Hello there. I've been looking forward to this immensely, having the opportunity to share some stone with you. Ah, this is exciting. And um, we're boring, and we don't know a lot about the mod, so we thought we'll just go caving. Yeah, just run around a bit, dig up some coal and other exciting ores, and yeah. uh, yeah, just see what, if we find anything. Oh, a stalactite! Ooh. Amazing. Give me that. There we go. I can place this. Is there? Which I I honestly have no idea what half these expansions are. Yes, I, I see a lot of stuff that is um, Galacticraft. Um, some people have been making big noises about going to the moon. I think Oh So Scottish has already been, and Oscar is on the cusp of going. And a lot of them are thermal expansion. Yeah, I've. I've seen uh, their missile silos, and I'm like, and I'm just trying to finish a roof. <laughs> oh, that's silicon. Um, I, I have done a little bit of uh, thermal expansion. I've, I've got, actually got um, some portable tanks that I can put lava in. Isn't that impressive? Yeah, uh, Scotty gifted me with a few of those. <laughs> he probably, probably hates me. I always call him Scotty. <laughs> I think he hates everyone. I call you by your name, you Scottish beautiful man. You. <laughs> what? What is this? What? Aluminum orberry bush. What? <gasps> oh, yeah. we're gonna have to fight over that because that's just beautiful. Do you, do you want the? Do you want the? Oh, thanks. I've got, I've got, and I've also been told I don't have to use a a um, shears. Mm. To get the bush, oh. it's you see, see. I was I was breaking these bushes with shears for ages, and eventually everyone told me I was doing it wrong. I th I thought the way it was supposed to work is I was supposed to do dumb stuff, and then people would leave comments on my videos to tell me I was doing dumb stuff. Yeah, that's that's normally what I expected, but uh, no, normally it doesn't work out that way. Normally the comments I get are like, "You should add me to the server." <laughs> I was like, "I don't have that power." Come down here. There's a iron here if you want it. Don't know about you, but I'm completely drenched in iron. I'm I'm actually kinda hurting for it because I've had to make so many tools to cut down all the wood. Alright. See when I started that project I didn't think this isn't world edit. I thought, let's go for it. <laughs> yeah, it's it's a bit like my um my my current big project. Uh, I'm working on a impressive tower in the nether. But the problem with impressive towers is you need quite a lot of materials. So I've just gone through all of my coal smelting uh, stone to make this. And now I'm hurting for coal, of all things. Yeah, I understand. Fortunately, there's lots of it around here. Now, I, now I do have to point out something, though. Mm -hmm. for, for those that didn't pay attention, we're not bats right now. Fall damage is very real possibility. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm game. Okay. And anyone familiar with my videos knows that I am the clumsy one. Well, I mean, we can be bats if you want to be bats. But, you know, I, I, I personally think it's so much easier for the viewers if they can tell which of us is which. Oh, careful. I don't mind. I live for danger. but <laughs> Well, I can tell by the way you just jumped in front of my pickaxe. <laughs> of course. I... I um... You know, it's kind of like back when I was in high school, you know, bullies would come after me and they'd be like, hey, I'm going to I'm gonna kick your ass. And I'd be like, well, OK, fine. Outside, your foot, my ass. Let's go. That's a true story, except for the parts I made up. <laughs> uh, and how did that work out for you? There's iron here. Um, well, spawn it, I, spawn it. And I just ran out of torches. For the most part, they had about the same reaction you would. And they'd giggle. Ooh, what's ruby ore? It's about to get blown up unless you pay attention. Oh, I've never seen that before. What, creeper? They're in vanilla. No, I meant, I meant the <laughs> creeper. Or, <laughs> I deal with way too many creepers. I also apologize for all the all the coughing. I've been a little sick. Oh, give me my coal back. I, I, don't, I don't want it. Okay, I, good, I don't good. Have it. You can have your iron back. Skeleton spawner. Oh, really? Yep. Quite a fairly populous one. Gee, I forgot to bring armor. Um, or weapons. Okay, I need your help in it. I'm coming. Gotta swim. I need to, 
retire and just heal up. I charged in in a very childish, not childish, naive, let's say. Naive kind of way. All right, spawner's broke. Cool. Oh, you broke it? Yeah. What if one of us wanted to make a, uh, a bone factory? Well, oops. Right. How many chests are there, by the way? I only see the one. All right. Um, well, there's two dragon eggs. So that's perfect. One for me, one for you. And there's a blue stone and a white stone. So which do you want? I'm not entirely sure what they're for. Okay. I'm going to take the saddle because, you know, finders keepers. But um, I'm going to take the blue stone. You take the white stone and the dragon egg. Okay. Ooh, a bucket. This is great because I lost my last one in a, in a creeper blast. What, what, didn't you just sort of tip the sewage out of the one I gave you? Or is that the one in question? That's that's the one I um, left in your present box where I spelt out hi or something. Uh, that's what that was. I, I wasn't sure about the... There's something nasty looking down here. Oil, maybe? Come check this out. I've lost you. Where did you run off to? I ran into the mine shafts. Did you drop torches? Yeah, there's torches. Well, then I am going the wrong way. Are you heading back? Uh, well, I went the know. other direction. Oh, there you are. Hello. Oh, right. You see me. There you are. Uh, yes, the, I think I found oil. Oh, mine shaft, not the... Okay, that was embarrassing. Never mind. So you yeah, be careful here. There's a, a puddle of something black and revolting looking. Hmm. It doesn't tell I me what, I is, what it is when I move my cursor over it. I think the part of the reason I ended up moving was I, uh, I was digging out a basement off camera and uh, I, I ran into the same black water stuff and uh, also Scottish tells me it's it's just water but it didn't act like water like if you covered it up and then you delete the block it's still there Ooh. Does it hurt if you jump in it? Uh, it didn't hurt but it was just impossible to get rid of Yeah I didn't like that much did it hurt? It, it didn't. It didn't hurt, but I, I didn't stay in for very long. It might have hurt if I'd exposed myself to it. Right. What have we got down here? A slag mite. Oh, there's another bush. An iron ore berry bush. Why on earth not? Oh, here's another uh, aluminum ore berry if you want it. Uh, no, I got the last one. You get that one. Just save my up. hand. But I'll do it. Got it. Iced stone. Archaeology reported. Do you want me to? I'll, I'll gather any iron ore I find. For cool. you. Thank you. I appreciate that. You'll have a few stacks by the end of this. So I'm still. Still trying to figure out the uh, the um, smeltery, and my understanding is you need diamonds and redstone to fix your tools. Okay. By the way, I've morphed into a cave spider, so don't be frightened. Actually, no, you should be frightened if you see a cave spider. I'll just look for the one with your name tag. Yeah, if it's not coming towards you in a threatening fashion, yeah. then uh, be fine. don't stab it. Silver. I do like all the fun new ores, but most of the time I find myself... Um, Baffled? Thinking, ooh, diamonds or something, and then I'll run over there and it'll be silver. And I'm like, trats. I, I find myself looking at all these various new things, and I think, I have no idea what that is but I'll grab some of it because it's inevitable that at some point in the future I'll want to do some really fantastic project and I'll think, oh, right, I need eight stacks of silicon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'll be like, oh, no, I got in the back. How handy. I figure I'll just collect a lot of it and then like towards the end of our, of our first season or however we end up running the server, having, oh, oh, you're not a nice cave spider. Ah, uh, found a spawner. Help. 
I don't want to die like this. No, is that the same one that I was looking at? Nope. As it might be. Don't know. All right, I gotta make a swift retreat. Become a bat and fly away. <laughs> it's hard to know whether we're anywhere near each other. I can see you. Okay. Or at least your name. Am I running away or towards? Away. Okay, so it was the same cave spider spawner, probably. Yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Now, here's one with this really cool, uh, cool hat. Now, I've, I've enjoyed these hat things immensely because I always get surprised. Like, there was a Dalek hat a while back that I got. A what? A Dalek hat, like the, the creatures on Doctor Who, the monsters. Oh, Dalek. Yeah. You and your crazy accent. Now, see, it's <laughs> Sorry, it was only a matter of time, wasn't it? Yeah. And now, now, um, now I, I, uh, I couldn't resist on July 4th. I teased my wife. I, oh, said, yeah. I said, hey, so I, I talked to Pete today. And she's like, really? But what did he say? I was like, he said the colonies are really rowdy today. And she's like, did he really? And then, then at that point, I have to keep it, right? I can't like, I can't just be like, no, that didn't actually happen. Oh, I no, just... no, you got to run with it, yeah. So I had to run with it now. So now she thinks that you are the most hilarious person ever. Well, you know, she might be right. I can't get credit for the joke until she watches this video, which she probably won't. So problem solved. I'm sure she will. She hasn't lost interest that quickly, has she? Um, well, eh. Yes and no. Oh. There's a skeleton up oh, below. Oh. There he is. I should find you again. I'm having way too much fun doing things. Oh, I hate where I am. Where are you? I'm in a corner with a creeper and a skeleton. I'm in the dark. Run for it. It could be worse. It could be worse. But I, I have... Oh, another one. I have done that thing where I've sort of run the wrong way down a one-way street and now I'm wondering how I'm ever going to get out. You know, sometimes you just advance a little bit too fast, don't you? Yeah. Well, this might be another... You know what I didn't bring with me? Food? No, I brought a little food. Well, not much, but a little. I failed to bring, and I'm really concerned I lost it in a creeper blast, the sword you gave me. Sack Ripper. Oh... That's, that would be sad. But I, I, we can rebuild it. Diamonds! Sorry, I just have to do that. I know that they're <laughs> everywhere. But... That's Sorry. Funny. Yeah. See, everyone well... else finds diamonds like that on the server, and I'm just like, ooh, diamonds! And it's silver again. <laughs> That's me every time. I haven't found much silver. To be honest, I, I don't find myself getting confused. I can still recognize diamonds. Well, I always see it from a distance. All right. And I race over there too excited to really think about it. And then it's ruined. Ah, speaking of uh, Scottish, he joined the game. Yeah, yeah, he was, he, was, he was around a bit earlier. All right. I want these diamond mine cart, uh, diamond, um, mine cart chests, as they often have. The loot seeming a little bit disappointing. Oh, oh, oh. And there's that crazy water. Well, oh, and lots of it. Found a rich vein of iron, but not you. I was looking for you. Found iron. <laughs> How do we feel about lapis lazuli? I think if it served more of a purpose... Yeah. Amazing. But it's pretty much there to look good when you turn it into a lapis block. Yeah. Well, in the, in newer versions of vanilla, I think it's essential for enchanting. Uh -huh. uh, but obviously, this this um, mod pack is based around 1.6, so right. it doesn't affect us too much. 
I haven't I haven't played just regular vanilla Minecraft in a really long time. Oh. Fortunately, we are in easy. Whoa, droppy. Uh, we are in easy mode, so um, we don't get poisoned by the poison spiders. Huh. I wondered why I was exceptionally good at this map. I hadn't done that much yet. Now it turns out we're on easy mode this whole time. Yeah. Hmm. I'm back to the green moss cave where that uh, skeleton sp spawner was. Oh, okay, back there. All right, well, I, I might make my way over there, throw some iron ore at you. I'm trying to decide if I want to take this moss stone with me. Certainly, I, I find it hard to move out of that mindset um, back in. Oh, hello. Cave spider. I'm not frightened. Um. Yeah, man. I don't know how you how long you've been playing Minecraft, but I've been playing since uh, about August two thousand and ten, I think. So quite a long time. Um, and there was a time when things like mossy cobblestone and clay were both very, very valuable indeed. And so that those were the things that you never missed up the opportunity to grab. All right. Okay, I'm backtracking. Well, I'm I'm working on just the detail on that house, and I'm like, once I finish the roof and I do that, do I want sand paths or do I want you know like a really cool mossy stone? Oh yeah. And so there's like, there's me questioning because again, I'm I'm been playing with World Edit a lot recently because I'm I'm working on getting a server up myself. All right, and um, it's been exceptionally behind with just life that I have been working on it. But it's like, oh, I can world edit. Everything will be so much faster. And then I come in here and I'm like, I can fly, so I should be mm. able to world edit slash less one. Oh, I forgot. Oh dear. Yeah, it's happened more than I care to admit. I've um. For me, it's it's about the uh, the journey as much as the destination. I've I've always had a very, um, I've I've never liked using tools very much. There's one tool I, I have, I have used quite a bit, which is a, a mod that's included in this mod pack that lets you see um, when where the dark areas are. If you press F7, then you can see red and yellow crosses on the ground that tell you uh, where the areas are that are dark enough for mobs to spawn. F7, huh? Yeah, and I've always found that quite useful because it sort of it lets you place the torches as sparsely as you can get away with. I found some uh, coal over here, by the way, for you. I think I've, I found some iron ore for you. There's there's some, and there's some more. And is that the lot? That's all I've got for you. Still, that's not bad, is it? That's really not. I I finally found my uh, my. All by myself, vein of diamonds. Oh. Yeah. And uh, you weren't you weren't kidding. I got eighteen for just like these little blocks over here. Oh yeah, I'm I'm carrying twenty one at the moment, and it's no big deal. <laughs> huh. Is that just part of the mod, or or is this yeah. just a really nice map? No, it's, uh, the the mod gives you vastly increased um, spawn rates of diamonds, so you get much bigger clusters, and you also get them much higher up. You don't have to go down to six level sixteen or whatever it is. You, you can get them almost anywhere. Uh, let me let me finish grabbing this mossy cobble because I might I might never need it, and then I might be like mossy cobble house. <laughs> I wonder if you can make it by combining like vines with cobblestone or something like that. Maybe that does seem like something you you should be able to do. Well, let's see what's over here. Quantum, quantum ore. Do you know what this Qcraft thing is? I see this, but I've never seen anything else for Qcraft other than quantum ore. Qcraft. I have no idea. I'm just curious enough to try to find out right now. Well, there's more quantum stuff. They're all quantum, quantum, quantum. 
Mm. Quantum goggles. Sweet. One way to approach this would be to take it one mod at a time. Say, right, you know, firstly, I'm going to learn everything about this mod. And then once I'm done that, I'm going to learn everything about such and such a mod. Right. That would be a very organized way to go about it. I, I'm kind of doing it more by utility. I'm, like, for example, at some point, I want to make a kebab. And to make a kebab, I need to get a salt. And to get salt, I think I need to go mining in the ocean. So at some point, I'm going to look into the possibility of making a diving helmet so that I can mine underwater much better. So, you know, going for a utility based thread. Now, I have to ask have you, um, have, have you not killed an aquatic creature? Have I killed any aquatic creatures? Just skipping through. Uh, no, I haven't. I've killed a few nether creatures. Because if you if you kill like a squid, uh, of course you can uh, you can just be underwater. You can be the, be the squid. Like, yeah, I keep forgetting about that. All powers of a squid. I was talking to someone about fire resistance potions, and they're like, "Why would you make a fire resistance potion when you can just turn into something that's fireproof?" Yeah, showing my noobishness. You can have those diamonds that have just plopped onto the floor if you like. Oh, thanks. There's another ore I don't recognize from the thermal expansion. Ferris. Hmm. Ferris. Oh, coal for you. Thank you. I threw a bit more iron at you. I appreciate that. Of course, if you throw all the coal at me, then you have nothing to smelt your iron with. Well, what, what do you smelt with? Do you smelt with coal, or do you have a... I normally use coal, yeah. but I've... I've come across a lot of coal. Ooh, that was the creeper blast there, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, that, that was me. I'm going to throw out another torch then. <laughs> so your your house move, how, how far away is that? Uh, it's just across the, uh, the the lake there. I mean, it wasn't, okay. wasn't bad. I mean, you can fly back over in just a couple minutes. That's probably a good thing I made the move after Darkcrawler started building that castle. Back, back, back. I was actually talking real life, sorry. <laughs> oh, oh. Sorry. I always feel weird asking for, for likes and subscribes. I feel like people are smart enough to just know to do that if they like something and want to see more of it. That, that is true, though. I, I do think that that little call to action does have an effect. I mean, one thing that does make me laugh is um, I mean, my, my son likes watching minecraft videos and you know often they'll finish up by saying you know do do like and subscribe it would be really great if we could get 10,000 likes for this video and you know the number 10,000 will flash up on the screen and you know it, it makes me want to finish up one of my videos by saying yeah do remember to like and subscribe it'd be really great if we get 8 billion likes on this video and I can flash up <laughs> the number 8 billion <laughs> go for it you know funny See if they see if they rise to the challenge. Gotcha. Yeah. Oh, pe peridot or probably pronounced perido. Ooh, ooh, ruby. Hello. I don't know what I need you for. It says biomes are plenty, but I'm not gonna deny it. It's probably just something to put in an item frame to look pretty in the house. Item frame pretty in the house. That's something I haven't thought of. Yes, yes, yeah, good, good suggestion. So my, my my inventory is not only getting full, but my my rucksack is as well. Oh yeah, I still don't don't even have anything like that. I'm actually pretty full. Hmm. Let's see. I could ditch some of these uh, things like lungs and uh, uh, cobblestone. I don't need those. I can certainly ditch a bit of iron. Ooh, what's that blue? Can't even pick it up. Uh, there's some more iron ore for you. Now, the thing is that I've discovered about myself is I will think ahead on caving to like bring a bunch of tools, bring ladders in case I need to climb my way out, mm -hmm. bring uh, bring um, you know clear inventory space, but I never think to bring food. Here's 
two pe- two bowls of fried rice. Thank you. You're welcome. It sounded like a a not so veiled request. Actually, it was it was mostly me pointing out my incompetence, but but that's that's why you have a buddy underground. You know, that's that's the system. Yeah, bring someone who's much more clever than you. Well, I imagine there's probably something essential that I'm lacking. That uh, I'm I'm down to thirty two. Actually, what am I talking about? Being running out of wood. We're in a mine shaft. Wood is not a problem. I've got. Um, I want to say. Um, fortune on this pick so if you'd yep. like a lot more coal I could mine it I've got fortune one. Ah, okay is that the same as the level that you've got I think so I'd, I'd have to double check it I could be completely wrong on that oh uh, no I was completely wrong it yep. was haste and luck uh, what does luck do does it be a lady tonight <laughs> <laughs> sorry sorry <laughs> No, no, that was far better than any joke I was about to make. I find that hard to believe. That was, that was great. Very clever. Stop it. Are you being sarcastic? No, I'm not being sarcastic. If I, were, oh. if I were going to be sarcastic, I would let you know. So, I've got this... Exit. I, I, I'm changing the subject completely. I have a program installed called FLUX. I don't know if you've heard of it, but what it does is it changes the color temperature of your screen once the sun goes down. Uh, It's all to do with sort of helping you sleep better, if you can believe that. So when the sun goes down, it sort of changes your screen to a a sort of more golden color. And it's, it's certainly got its uses, but I'm finding it to be more annoying than helpful lately. Well, um, you know, you know what I do when I need the light on my computer to be off. You turn the computer off. I turn the computer off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but I can't do that. No. Now, why going. is that? <laughs> no idea. No idea. But but my my inventory is double full. I've got like two empty slots left. Well, I mean, we could head back to the surface and unload. Should we dig straight up? Sure. Why not? All right, let's make it. Let's do. Let's do it staircase style, because then you can reuse it later easily. Yeah. Oh, gravelly. What level are we at? Oh, Thirty-eight. It won't take us long then. I believe some... in you. I'll just be back here watching, waiting. Oh, here again, there's there's some there's some iron for you to pick up as well. Limestone. Chisel. I always get chisel and tinker. Like confused. Yours. I feel like they're practically the same mod to me. Look, diamond. Look, do you see that? Diamond, diamond. At level, what level 48. 48. Holy cow. Hey, oh! Oh, watch out. I don't know. Oh, uh oh. Well, Sorry. This is gone. Everything. On the bright side, there's got to be a. Are we drowning a bit? Okay. A little bit. Right, I've, I've blocked that off. Oh, that um, works. How do we get out of this? Change the direction the stairs go. Just yeah, but there's all that diamond. And that there? In the we water? Might be under a large body of water. Oh, oh, more water. Me. Well, let me at least. I'm going to make a little block there for what reason I know not and let me see if I can here yeah I uh I'm... are you over the okay. top of it leading total derp here nope that didn't go the way I wanted it to okay well what I am going to do is I'm going to pop a to- oh. Um... Grab attack <coughs> oh swim straight up trying to drown Place a torch every now and then if you need to. There we go. You gonna make it? I'm hopeful. I can do it. I can do it. Woo! You can do it. We didn't get all the diamonds, but we are now in a place I know not of. Actually, I know where this is. Oh, come over oh, here. Yeah. This is fun. 
I can see the uh, the ravine on the map. Do you see the uh, big green? Looks like a blimp thing on the map. I I do. Those are. And then at, look around, and you're like, "Hey, where is it? Right? There's nothing here." Yeah. But look straight up. I can tell you haven't been watching all my videos religiously. I, I've been so busy working on that server. I haven't been on YouTube in like two weeks. So th these floating islands, they're, they're fairly boring actually, aren't they? They really are. But I, I was sitting there. I'm like, there's nothing here. And I'm like, Darkcrawler, stop whatever you're doing and come all the way over here. And he comes over and he's like, look up. And I'm like, um, um, oops. Because <laughs> it never occurred to me that something could be above us. There's a similar phenomenon in the nether. You might see yellow squares on the map when you're in the nether. And they're beehives. And they are vicious. No, not beehives. They're wasp hives. And yeah, the, the wasps are nasty. Very nasty. Well, um... I'm back over here, which is the house. Oh, you're at the house. Okay, I am coming. Pretty convenient. I'm being chased by a very angry spider, but nothing being a bat won't solve. Well, I'll tell you what, do you fancy coming over to see what I'm working on in the nether at the moment? Sure, I'd love to. Okay. Let me, uh, let me, let me come in here and drop off my stuff. Absolutely. Yep. Yeah. I shall yeah. sort of zip around in your attic. Enjoying the, uh... now, I might need help. You might know how to pronounce this. M-O-I-R-E. It's the word where sort of all your parallel lines and perpendicular lines make funny diamond patterns. Now, is it um, moir? Or is it moiri? I'm not familiar with the word, actually. I'm... All right, well, there you have it. Um, grammar and, and uh, punctuation with Pete. Yeah, word of the day. Word of the day. I'm like, and I'm an English teacher, and I'm like, that that stumped me. <laughs> what well, are you teaching the kids? Uh, not not that word, whatever that is. I'm I'm gonna chalk that up to um, culture difference. Okay. And assume that that's just um, some regular everyday word I know very well over here. Yeah. yeah. That you're British and uh, you messed it up. By pronouncing it properly. Well, I reckon it's a French word. So, moi, I guess, might be it. And you get a pass, because you're not a French teacher. Ah, problem solved. Are you ready to see the Nether Tower now? Yes, I'm, I'm quite excited. 